the 142nd Westminster Kennel Club Dog Show. Launched in 1877, it is America's second longest continuously held sporting event behind the Kentucky Derby. To fully grasp Westminster's place in history, it predates the invention of the light bulb, the automobile, the zipper, the building of the Brooklyn Bridge, basketball, and the establishment of the World Series in baseball. There are some 2,800 dogs here all competing for that most coveted award in the dog show world, best in show at Westminster. So let's go meet some of the handlers and owners and also see some of the personalities of these purebred dogs. Okay, now who do we have here? This is Odin. And, and what type of dog is Odin? He's a Bouvier de Flanders. And, and tell me about uh, the breed. Well, they're a herding breed from Belgium. Um, originally used to uh, be used to, to pull carts, but they're more of a, a herding breed now for sheep and, and you know livestock and that sort of thing. And so he, he lives Taylor. in um, he lives in the Bay Area, San Francisco Bay Area, and Portola Valley. So we came all the way from California, um, flew him out here, and this is our first uh, first trip to Westminster. And are you out in uh, the open air or, or? Yeah, in, in yeah. He lives uh, amongst the trees. We, we live in a real real wooded area, so he's got a lot of. A lot of area to run around, and uh, yeah, yeah. So he likes a lot of exercise. A lot, a lot of exercise, yeah. And what sure. about grooming? Yeah, it's a big, big part of the breed for sure. It takes a lot. They um, do a lot of stripping. So these these dogs, um, people do either hand stripping or they use a stripping knife. So it kind uh -huh. of depends. Um, but yeah, that's that's a big part of it. A lot of brushing, a lot of combing, and, and the stripping of the of the coat. So you get you strip the coat down until it becomes really uh, coarse. And that's what I, I think a lot of judges look for and people expect from the breed. And uh, uh, tell me about some of his uh, competitions. Uh, well, this is his 10th show. He won the, the Nationals, so that was a really big one for him because it's kind of rare and it, it was only his ninth show. And he's, he's pretty young. He's only two. Oh. Um, so, he's, so this is kind of a new thing for him and it's a new thing for, for us as well. We haven't really done uh, the dog show thing before, but uh, based on his, his dad was a big dog show winner and mm -hmm. so we wanted to make sure that we finished him to his championship and then we kind of got into it and and when we got the invitation here we, we kind of had to had to check it out oh, and how much does he weigh he's about 95 95, 95 pounds? pounds yeah okay how much will he go up to do you think or is it no, that's hard to say oh, I mean, we'll <laughs> see they, they keep growing until a little over three uh -huh, and then uh -huh, then it probably uh -huh. will he'll you know cap off but yeah oh, well welcome and and how's he adapting to new york city i, I think he likes it he might like the, the where we are a little bit better, but maybe that's the weather has something to do with it. Although he really likes cool weather because of the coat. Okay. Yeah. Well, welcome. Yeah, thank you so much. Hey, congratulations there. Thank you very much. All right.